Hey guys, we're back. It's me, Beardy, Kay, and Larry again. Today we're going to tell you nine of the first things girls notice about guys. I watched Coco Chanel's video about this and thought, hey, we could add some things to that list. So here we are with this brand new video aimed at helping you continue to learn how to attract women and how to get girls to like you. Plus, towards the end of the video, we're going to be cluing you in on the one thing that they don't pay attention to. Are you ready yet? Let's get it on. Number seven, G, low energy. Low energy. It's boring. And makes people feel sleepy and not engaged. So whenever you're out and have the potential to meet women, it's absolutely necessary to be sure you're not a low energy bum, but an energetic guy who's always smiling and capable of having a great conversation. This is because that high energy is one of the first things girls notice about guys, and it's exactly one of the tricks to get girls to chase you. Of course, to make that high energy an integrated part of your personality takes some kind of work. Plus, you need to make sure you're not overdoing it, otherwise you'll come off as fake. And I tell you, that's the opposite of how to impress a girl. You need to make it look like it's natural for you to always have that high energy and not that you're just trying hard to impress her. That's not how to get a girl to like you. So how do you do that? Well, do things that make you energetic, like living a healthy lifestyle and of course, not eating junk. That's what I did during my college days and boy, my energy level was amazing and I still always get the compliment that my energy is so high that it's contagious. Guys, that's how to be more attractive to women. Well, that and knowing different tricks to get girls to chase you. Do something about it by watching this video right here. It's got almost 3 million views already. That can't be bad, right? Number six, body buddy. Seriously, exercise is extremely important if you want to learn how to be attractive to women. That's because not only will exercise give you more energy and confidence, it'll give your body tone and definition. You know what that means? It means your clothes will fit better. And if you're wearing clothes that fit properly, your physique will be one of the first things girls notice about you. It's a main key to learning how to attract women. Just be sure you don't skip leg day because then you'll look like a chicken. Remember, this doesn't have to be extreme. For me, a 15-minute run every morning or a round of push-ups does the trick. Each and every one of us is different, so pick your own potion. It doesn't matter what kind of exercise you choose. It will help you in your quest of learning how to attract 99.9% .9 of girls. What matters is, is that you start the habit now, because a neat, healthy body is one of the many things you just simply cannot force into happening overnight. It requires hard work, patience, and dedication. But hey, don't get discouraged. Well, it sounds like a lot of work, it is worth it. After all, when you're learning how to approach a girl, you can never go wrong with a body that you're confident with. It goes hand in hand with the fact that you're able to have that body because you know how to take care of yourself. And yes, that's an indication that you can take care of other things in your life. For instance, a relationship? To make sure you've really got it covered, check out this video we've made about attracting 99.9% .9 of women. It's got over 300,000 views already. Number five, accessory story. Okay, let's face it. Accessories play a huge part when it comes to our physical appearance, which is one of the first things girls notice about guys. Yep, let's get real here. Before anybody gets the chance to admire your good habits, the first thing they'll notice is what the eyes can actually see. Men don't have as many accessories as women, but that makes accessories all the more noticeable in men. This is why you should pay extra attention to this tip. It will help you a great deal when learning how to get a girl to like you. Number four, watch your words. Okay, listen to this carefully because we're going to tell you one of the habits women love. Picture this. You walk into a bar and say to the bartender, I'll have a vodka cranberry. No please, no thank you, no hey, how are you? Well, maybe you rationalize, you're straight to the point, and you don't waste time with the niceties. However, when you talk to people like that and ignore all the words that make you sound more genuine and friendly with everyone within earshot, you'll notice that they will likely form a very unfavorable opinion about you. Wait, why does that sound so familiar? Are you talking about Greg? Oops, I didn't mention any name, you know? Anyway, what I was trying to say here is that being friendly isn't a weakness, nor is it some kind of body language that attracts women. It simply lets other people know that you have manners and who doesn't like manners? Being socially capable is one of the most important tricks when learning how to get girls to like you that you should be working on every single day. This way, it becomes a way of life and a habit. Just like they say, habits aren't formed overnight. You gotta do the work. Start by learning about the rest of the habits women love in this video. We published, which has racked up over 750,000 views already. Hey, 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 I know you're aching to watch more of our videos, but don't leave just yet. We have three more things in our list of first things girls notice about guys. Plus, at the end of this video, we're also telling you the number one things girls don't pay attention to, so you shouldn't bother. Let's get back to the good stuff.
Number three, the ha 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 hello. When you say the letter H, it gives off a ha huh sound. And if your breath is stinky, the girl you're saying hello to will get a nice, healthy whiff of it. So what do you need to do? Make sure that you're confident about how your breath smells. So brush your teeth, brush your tongue, floss those gaps, and chew some gum. Because if your breath smells like death, you're doing it wrong. That's definitely not going to help you attract women. Luckily, this is one of the easiest things to remedy. Practicing proper mouth hygiene will get you far in this game. Just remember that not only are you making women want you more, you're also doing yourself a big favor and saving a lot of money you'd more than likely pay for in dental services should you decide otherwise. Now, if that still doesn't sound convincing enough to you, maybe this next item will. Number two, on the scent. While we're on the subject of bad breath, I should also mention the other odors you give off. No matter how much you get yourself acquainted with the alpha male body language tricks every guy should do today, all of your efforts will be gone with the wind once the air that reaches your crush's nose smells like garbage. This is because our noses are sensitive, and while our eyes have the first say about the things that getting noticed immediately are, the nose is near and clear second. Now, if you're not cleaning yourself properly, your nose will get used to it, but it will be one of the first things everyone, not just girls, will notice about you. So please guys, for the sake of everyone around you, clean yourself thoroughly and wear some deodorant. You don't want to be identified by your crush as the stinky one. Oh, that is the worst. Not only is it an instant turnoff, it's ultimately a lasting impression, which will be very hard to change if you're going to get a chance at all. So don't ever let yourself get into a bad situation. Always smell your best because you may not know when that special moment might come. Don't let yourself be caught off guard. Do something about it by learning the alpha male body language tricks every guy should do today, and you'll surely be the champ. Number one, manic cure. This may sound weird, but one of the first things girls notice about guys is their fingernails. Because if a girl thinks you're attractive, she's hoping your hands will end up with hers. But not if there's dirt in between your nails and they haven't been clipped in what looks like months. She may like having your hands clasped together, but not when yours are gross. So give your nails some lovin'. Treat yourself to a manicure, or at least clip your claws and get some soap under them. This is because clean fingernails are one of the many items that make you more attractive. And yes, dirty nails do just the opposite. Man, you've surely heard of a nail cutter, right? And just like that, once again, we're back to hygiene. We can't stress this enough. If a man practices proper hygiene, that speaks volumes about him. Oh yes, we have not forgotten about our promise. You've reached the point where we're now going to tell you about the number one thing that girls don't pay attention to. Well, at least the high caliber ones. Ready? Well, high caliber women don't pay attention to your wealth. Yep, I know a lot of you wouldn't agree because society and the media tells us otherwise, but it's the truth. The kind of woman you want is one that doesn't notice a man's wealth. This is because she knows that there's more to a man than his wallet. So don't try to get her to notice by flaunting your car or boasting about how thick your wallet is. She won't be impressed. And if she is, then you know where to go. Head to the nearest exit while you still can. Do you know of any other things that girls notice first about guys? Let us know in the comments section below. Gentlemen, now that you know what girls notice first about guys, we know you won't want to be at a loss when the question, what do girls find attractive in guys, comes at you. But are you really sure you've got the dating game covered? If not, then we know how to help you when learning how to get girls to like you. We have a video especially made to help you attract 99.9% .9 of girls. Check it out here.